Hi there guys and thank you for tuning in with Moongrass TV once again. Um, for a while now I've been wanting to do a video around home audio and uh, home theater because it's one of my biggest passions and um, you know honestly I have spent hundreds if not thousands of hours doing research in the internet, um, auditioning equipment inside my apartment and outside in uh, places where they sell uh, high-end audio equipment. Um, in this video, what I want to do is try to teach you how to how to get the 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 gear, the equipment, the system that you want, spending the least amount of money. So, how to put a system together on a budget? And I'm gonna have to maybe divide this in a couple of videos. Um, first, I want to cover audio itself. Okay. The audio world is very complex, it's like an ocean, it's vast, it's huge, and it can be very confusing, uh, deceiving, and um, you know, one can really get confused, you, you get in the internet, you start looking at products, <clears throat> checking um, reviews, reviews are great, however, I'm going to tell you, Never ever ever be, you know base uh, a sale or a purchase. Never purchase an item based on a review that you read. There's nothing better than this. Your ear to make a decision on a purchase. Okay, so don't ever fall in that trap of buying something because of a review. <clears throat> Reviews are great. They are a starting point, they are a, gui a gui guideline, but uh, don't make your purchase uh, based on a review solely. Okay, the best thing to do is audition, audition, audition. If you can audition at home, at home, perfect. Outside, you know, find places where you can go and, and, and try the products that you're interested in. Okay, um, audio is very personal. It's, uh, it's just like food taste, okay? Some people like um, seafood, some, not, some other people don't. Uh, some people uh, love to eat meat, some other people don't. So that is the same that is on the audio world. Um, you know, we all have different tastes. Um, you know, what I like may well, may well not be what you like. So, and w nobody's wrong. It's what we like, okay? And it doesn't matter the price tag. Um, imagine that you get uh, put on a table and uh, you get two bottles of wine that you don't know to try. One is a $5 bottle of wine. The other one is a $10,000 bottle of wine. You get to try them both and you say, you know what? This is the one that I like. This is the wine that I like. And, and it turns out that the wine that you chose is the $5 bottle of wine. Guess what? There's nothing wrong with that. That's what you liked. That's what your palate is telling you it likes. There's nothing wrong with that. That's what you like. Don't let, in this world, you're going to have, you're going to find people trying to <clears throat> get you to, to go their way with what they like. That's a trap really go with what you like. If what you like is a hundred dollar piece of equipment as opposed to a five thousand dollar piece of equipment that someone may be trying to sell you, hey, go with what you like. That's what's going to make you happy. Okay? Uh, this is uh, going to be my first video. Uh, my, my, you know, I really want to give you guys the, um, you know, a sense of the audio world because it can really get to be very confusing. Um, you know, one can spend hundreds of hours doing research like I have done. Um, I've had like maybe five different pair of speakers in my own apartment already. I finally have a system that, um, that I love. And uh, I was doing some math. Um, my system right now, uh, if I would have purchased everything new, I would have spent somewhere in the $11,000 range. I've done it with a small fraction of that and that's what I want to teach you guys. How to get your dream system spending 
the smallest amount of money possible. And uh, that's what we're going to start discussing in the next video. Thank you so much for tuning with Moongrass TV. Check the next video. This is Joel. Thank you.